hello everyone welcome to the mathematics in my channel in this video i am going to solve this nice integral integral from 0 to pi over 4 natural log of tan of x raised to the 20 22 power well uh, i am going to generalize the integral so uh, we can take i is equal to integral from 0 to pi over 4 natural log of tan of x raised to the k power dx well, uh, then as a next step, I am going to use a uh, substitution. So, I am going to take x is equal to arc tan of y. Uh, then we should differentiate. So, dx is equal to dy over 1 plus y square. Now, we can uh, plug in. So, we can write now i is equal to now we should change the boundary when uh, lower limit when x approaches to 0 arc tan of 0 we know here 0 upper limit when x approaches to 5 over 4 arc tan of 5 over 4 we know 1 then here we have natural log of tan of x uh, we know tan of x is equal to y so uh, here we have natural log raised to the k power of y then dx dx we know dy over 1 plus y square so 1 plus y square here dy okay then uh, as a next step uh, instead of 1 over 1 plus y square we can use a uh, infinite series so we can write integral from 0 to 1 infinite sum n is equal 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power y to the 2n power and here we have natural log raised to the k power of y dy okay then uh, now uh, we can uh, simplify uh, now we can interchange uh, integral sign and sigma notation so here we have n is equal 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power integral from 0 to 1 y to the 2n power times natural log raised to the k times y dy okay then uh, we can again uh, use the substitution so i am going to take uh, t is equal to minus natural log of y uh, then here we know if we differentiate dt is equal to minus 1 over y dy but uh, here uh, we know y is equal to uh, e to the minus t so dt is equal to uh, here minus 1 over e to the minus t dy okay now uh, we can plug in here so here now we have uh, sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n now we should change the boundary when y approaches to 0 uh, here when y approaches to 0 we know uh, t approaches to infinity upper limit when y approaches to 1 here 0 then uh, y to the 2n y we know e to the minus t so we have e to the minus t here 2n power so minus 2n t uh, times here natural log of y we know natural log of y is equal to minus t so minus t raised to the k power times dy dy we know uh, here dy is equal to minus minus e to the minus t times dt okay then uh, we can simplify <coughs> here sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power and here we have minus t to the k so we can take minus 1 to the k power integral now limit we have infinity to 0 but here we have minus sign when we change the uh, boundaries uh, this minus sign get cancelled so here we have 0 to infinity now uh, here e to the uh, minus 2nt here minus t so e to the minus t we can take as a common factor so here 2n plus 1 power times t to the k power dt 
ओके देन स्टिल वी कैन सिंप्लीफाई सो बिफोर इट हियर वी हैव माइनस टी टाइम्स टू एन प्लस वन सो वी कैन टेक अनदर सब्सटिट्यूशन सो आई एम गोइंग टू टेक u is equal to t times 2n plus 1 uh, then if we differentiate du is equal to 2n plus 1 times dt so we can uh, plug in so here uh, now here we have minus 1 to the k power so we can write minus 1 to the k power uh, outside of the sigma notation here n is equal 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power uh, integral uh, now limit we know also 0 to infinity here e to the t times 2n plus 1 we know u so minus u t to the k t we know here we can isolate the t u over 2n plus 1 so u over 2n plus 1 raised to the k power and dt we know du over 2n plus 1 okay then uh, here Minus one to the k power uh, sum of zero to infinity. Here we have minus one to the n power, and here two n plus one raised to the k power. Here two n plus one, so we have two n plus one raised to the k plus one power. Integral from zero to infinity. Now here we have e to the minus u times u to the k times d u. Okay then. Uh, i think uh, you know about uh, this functions the definition of uh, dirichlet uh, beta function uh, we used uh, in mm, previous videos to solve uh, some questions uh, dirichlet beta function uh, is equal to sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n over 2n plus 1 raised to the s power and also we know about the definition of gamma function gamma of c is equal to integral from 0 to infinity e to the minus x times x to the c minus 1 dx so now here minus 1 to the k power now we know uh, this is uh, dirichlet uh, beta function so beta of k plus 1 Times now here this is we know definition of gamma function so gamma of k plus one okay now uh, this is the answer for the uh, generalized integral now instead of k uh, you can plug in twenty twenty two okay if you like this type of videos uh, please uh, subscribe this channel thank you for watching.